Hey guys, Morgan's Maintenance. Today's tour review is going to be a screwdriver set from Vessel. Probably my favorite all-around screwdriver brand at the moment. It's not like they're... I, don't like other screwdrivers but as far as my main screwdrivers i use every day i use these ball handles all the time they're my favorite and this is their insulated set it's going to run you about 36 bucks on amazon at least right now it says it's a limited time deal but i think it kind of stays close to that price all the time and it's a five piece set so five into 36 you're a little over seven dollars a screwdriver that's not too bad for insulated screwdrivers especially with the features that thieves have and I hadn't bought these yet, mainly because, you know, the black vessel screwdriver, the first one I bought, it's a good screwdriver as far as grip and all those things. I just felt like it was a little bit light. I didn't care for it that much. And then what really drew me into going to Vessel is all these tang through screwdrivers. I like the weight of them, the fact that you have the strike cap if you want it. All around, by far, my favorite screwdriver. And I just fell in love with the ball grip. So... Ultimately, though, there's not really any insulated screwdrivers, even though I don't like the weight of the black one. There's not very many insulated screwdrivers that really weigh a whole awful lot out there anyways. They're all fairly light. So I decided I'm going to go ahead and pull the plug on these uh, and go ahead and get these. So basically, here's the packaging that you're going to get. There's the sizes and all those things, which I'm going to show you here in a minute. But if you want to pause that and kind of look at that, you can. It also gives you, you know, made in Japan and all that kind of stuff. But these screwdrivers also have quite a few nice features for insulated screwdrivers, in my opinion. So you get a Phillips number three. It's 150 millimeter in length and Phillips number three on the tip there. Uh, so that's the longest one that you're going to get. Has all that knurling, you know, good for you to be able to stick that there. You got knurling here to stick your fingers in that kind of a situation. And you can also get grip on that ball by doing this. Uh, and then you get into, you get a slotted number five by 75 millimeter. You get a Phillips number one by 75 millimeter, a slotted number six, and these are 100 millimeter, and then a Phillips number two. And they are Phillips. I was curious to see if they were Phillips or Posi Drive, but they are Phillips. Uh, so just so you know that ahead of time. Now, the things I think that are nice about them one is the color scheme. All the slotteds have this orange knurling. And then all the Phillips have this red knurling. So that kind of helps you differentiate the two. Or you look up here at the top, you have Phillips and slotted showing up. Now, it doesn't give you like a Phillips 1, but obviously you're going to know the difference between Phillips 1 and Phillips 2 because of the size. Uh, now, the Phillips 2 and the Phillips 3, it would be hard to tell unless you can somehow figure out what the length of it is. But I do also like the fact that these aren't just like a, a printed on top. Those are etched down in there. That's like a... A lip right there so you can even take a marker and fill that in which is probably what I'm gonna do but I didn't want to do that before I film the video so you could see them how they are uh, but the even the slotted this line is a, a, a lipped in edge there so it's actually indented down in there to help you help that stay there for a longer period of time so you know you could look down inside your pouch you can see the orange that lets you know slotted or red Phillips but then you can also see those to let you know that as well and then when you flip to the tip uh, you have the slim line on these where that edge goes straight to the tip. Uh, you don't have a little lip right here. For example, on these Vera screwdrivers, you can see I've got that little lip. And the Veras aren't that bad, you know, but there's certain brands out there where that becomes a pretty significant difference between that and the slim line that you have on these vessels. So sometimes you can't get into breakers. You can't get in certain situations this is the way to go in my opinion if you can find insulated screwdrivers that have this i much prefer this as i've mentioned before i think in the milwaukee video that's why i bought those to try out as well and then last thing is just like the milwaukee screwdrivers that i just recently reviewed these tips are also uh, magnetic you can kind of feel them sticking together right there not super magnetic but again some magnetism is better than nothing uh, if i take this down there take that phillips and put that on there you can see it's enough to pick up the screw if i shake it at all it's going to come off and if you have a really long screw you know it's not going to kind of it's going to be enough magnetism that if you are careful going in somewhere it's going to stay on there but if i shake it at all you know it's going to eventually come off there so not super magnetic but some magnetic uh, so that's better than nothing in my opinion so those are all really good features about these and again the ball handle if you haven't tried a vessel ball handle yet I highly recommend you go find you a tank through and try that out. But even if you haven't, don't want to get one of those and you want insulated screwdrivers, I feel like to me, this option right here, being able to do this in certain situations and then really being able to crank down on it by grabbing a hold of that ball, 
I really like Vessel screwdrivers. So you might want to check these out again. I think for the price, you're getting five of them here. I do wish that they had a square one and a square two or ECX or something along those lines. But for the price, I think that these are a really good fit at, you know, $7 a piece, five different screwdrivers. I probably won't use that Phillips three very much, but these other four right here will kind of get put into the rotation and I'll see how well they work. But just letting you know that they're out there for all of you that have grown into be vessel fans like I have, and you haven't got a good set of insulated screwdrivers, uh, this might be the set that you want to pick up. I think again, good price, good features all the way around. I'd highly recommend these so far. Again, I haven't put them into use uh in a big amount of way yet but I, I i don't expect them to be a bad screwdriver so let me know in the comments below what you think about them if you've got them you've had them for a while let us know how they've been holding up for you but as always hope this is useful in some way you guys stay safe have a blessed day see you on the next video